After decades of colonialism and neo-colonialism, it was France's withdrawal from Mali last year and Burkina Faso this year, which emphatically confirmed the shifting geopolitics in Central Africa. French troops were forced to leave when the military junta in each of those countries opted for a new alliance with Russia in the form of the mercenary Wagner Group. President Macron openly admits that mistakes were made in Mali and his four-nation tour of Central Africa will sell a more cooperative vision with host nations. Cultural, scientific and educational partnerships and military bases where the French troops operate as partners rather than commanders. The reorganization is not meant to be a retreat or a disengagement. It will materialize through an Africanization or mutual operation of these big bases. General Dominique Trancon is the former head of the French military mission at the United Nations. He agrees the importance of France staying militarily engaged in the region. We have to have small teams, air power for example, to help this African country. This is exactly the case in Niger for example, where the parliament asks the French forces to stay and to fight in support of the Nigerian forces. That's probably the case also in Chad where we put a big air base. In Central Africa itself, some see the rejection of French influence as understandable, but nonetheless alarming and irrational. Yes, there is anger about European neocolonialism. However, the alliances being offered by China and Russia bring their own issues. The Western world has abused its position, its, its position of do domination. It's a very difficult period in, in our history because uh, when People are not rational anymore, like now. They just have one, one goal. We want to get rid of France. We want to get, get rid of the old system, actually. And, and, and not realizing that uh, uh, what is ahead is not probably better than what they are running away from. President Macron embarks on this tour, admitting that for too long France has regarded Africa with what he described as the logic of rent. His new vision is to offer a more mutually beneficial partnership. But he faces an uphill task to turn around that wave of anti-French sentiment. Paul Brennan, Al Jazeera, Paris.